الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم اما بعد ايها الاحباب may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us and bless you and forgive us and forgive you and guide us and guide you amin ya rabbil alamin ايها الاحباب adhering to the sunnah of the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa ala alihi wa sallam is imperative and that is our goal because we want jannah we want paradise so avoiding those questionable practices and those questionable groups and sects who say that they have a particular way or a particular methodology which does not conform to the Quran and does not conform to the sunnah of the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and does not conform to the methodology of the salaf of this ummah then ayyul ahbab run then it is for you to make a choice do you wish guidance or do you wish that which is going to take you away from the sabila mu'minin and the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala azza wa jal listen to this athar of one of our salaf the salaf of this ummah abdullah bin mas'ud radiyallahu ta'ala anhu an abdullah ibn mas'ud radiyallahu ta'ala anhu qal alaykum bit tariq fala in lazam lazumtumuhu لقد سبقتم سبقا بعيدا ولئن خالفتموه يمينا وشمالا لقد ضللتم ضلالا بعيدا it was reported on Abdullah bin Mas'ud رضي الله تعالى عنه who said you must adhere to the path therefore if you follow it then you have proceeded a very uh, far distance However, if you diverge from it to the right or to the left, then you have deviated extreme deviation. Ayyul Ahbab, the wisdom of the Salaf of this Ummah is the way our Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala chose to preserve this religion. By giving us a Salaf, by giving us pious predecessors who understood the text who were there to witness the revelation being revealed to Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, who understood the verses, and who were the best of this ummah, because they were the companions of the Messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, radiyallahu ta'ala majma'een. And if you think that there's a new way, a new way of understanding, something that is permissible that was not permissible in their time, then you need to look again and you need to check your iman and you need to put your desires on the shelf and adhere to the path as Abdullah ibn Mas'ud radiallahu ta'ala anhu said and we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil and bless us to be of those who adhere to the straight path wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad